Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. I'd really love that. If you're returning, how you doing? So, um, we're going to be talking about something that I, I'm having a lot of trouble believing, okay? I mean, please tell me to wake up, all right? Pinch me, do something, okay? Because eyebrows are raising right now. Alarm bells are ringing. And this is over the possibility of a massive <laughs> global war in less than three months before the general election. All right. Now, I generally don't follow the New York Times. All right. But I do follow the Gateway Pundit. And I saw this on their um, website and I'm like, no. So the New York Times reported that the United States is reportedly preparing for possible nuclear confrontations with three of the most dangerous adversaries or that's what they're saying and that would be Russia China and North Korea in the future back in March uh, Biden approved a highly classified nuclear strategic plan called the nuclear employment guidance to deal with the threat with a particular focus on China and their rapidly expanding nuclear arsenal okay and the plan is updated approximately every four years all right. Now, Biden approved in March a highly classified nuclear strategic plan for the United States that, for the first time, um, reorients America's deterrent strategy to focus on China's rapid expansion into its nuclear arsenal. And this shift comes as the, the Pentagon believes that China, China and their stockpile will rival the size and the diversity of the United States and Russia over the next decade. So, the White House, they never announced that Biden had approved this revised strategy called the Nuclear Employment Guidance, which also newly seeks to prepare the United States for possible coordinated uh, nuclear challenges from Russia, China, and North Korea. But the document which is updated every four years or so, like I said, is so highly classified that there is no electronic copies. Only a small number of hard copies are even distributed to a few national security officials as well as Pentagon commanders. So the president recently issued updated nuclear weapon employment guidance to account for multiple nuclear armed adversaries all right now there is no known immediate nuclear threat that is emanating from these countries at this point in time and it is unclear why this story is now being leaked especially since it is so highly classified i i'm having that's why i'm having a very 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 hard time understanding this right now one could argue that this could be election interference believing that this type of story would set off panic across social media, across the country. I mean, if this is true, then this form of journalism from the New York Times is highly, highly irresponsible. 
So, with that being said, I want you to seriously do some digging. If I had more time, I would do some serious digging. Um, but I know that the gate, uh, gateway is, um, they don't generally put anything out unless they've dug themselves. That's why I went with their article and no one else's. Um, but the New York Times, seriously, if this is farce in any way, they need to be shut the hell down because this this lit a fire under my ass and that doesn't happen ever you know um so have you guys heard about this have you seen anything on x twitter whatever the hell it's called have you heard family members or friends saying hey did you hear what just you know what i mean so email me all right let's talk all right all right guys i'm out of here i'll see you guys in the next ones you stay safe you stay positive you keep prepping and as always fearless ciao